Hello, I'm Shakun Salasantran with the top stories here on Al Jazeera. Pakistan's Supreme Court has issued an arrest warrant for the Prime Minister. It relates to corruption charges when he was Minister for Water and Power. And this comes as Pakistani cleric Tahir ul Qadri is demanding that the country's parliament and national assemblies be dissolved due to corruption. He's been addressing tens of thousands of protesters who've gathered in Islamabad. Osama bin Javid has more from the Pakistani capital. The authorities seem ready for any, uh, any uh, event that follows. There are containers that, are, that have been set up uh, to block uh, him marching towards uh, the Parliament House's uh, Parliament House, as well as the Presidency and the Supreme Court, which is a few hundred meters away from where we are. Under pressure to get troops into Mali, West African military chiefs are working on a deployment plan in the Malian capital, Bamako. Some 750 more French soldiers have joined those already stationed in Bamako. France has been bombing rebel bases for five days now. More than 50 countries have asked the UN Security Council to refer the Syrian crisis to the International Criminal Court. The ICC prosecute people for genocide and war crimes. Both sides have been accused of committing atrocities. And Sri Lanka's president has sworn in a new chief justice, Mohan Paris, after the previous judge was impeached. Shirani Bandaranaika was dismissed on Sunday after being found guilty of corruption. But judges ruled that her impeachment was illegal and unconstitutional. You can find the latest on all those stories and much more at aljazeera.com.